was going to have this in the background with my green screen, but the color of this shirt is not letting the green screen balance properly, so I'm just going to jump right into this. What's up, travelers? I just got back from BookCon, and it was so great. There were so many panels I went to, and I usually don't go to panels when I go to conventions. I went to the Hate You Give panel, I went to the Darkest Mind panel, I went to We Need Diverse Books panel. It was it was just a blast. But on to what you're actually here for, all the swag I picked up. I'm gonna start with what I picked up with at the Scholastics uh, table. For the 20th year of Harry Potter, they were giving out this, oh, it's upside down. This beautiful poster. Speaking of Harry Potter, I went to a PBS Great American Read pan panel where we voted on which book was the greatest read and Harry Potter won, beat out, you know, Lord of the Rings, Hunger Games, Fifty Shades of Grey. Although I, I really was kind of starting to pull for Moby Dick because if you heard the way the guy defended that book, oh, it would have been great. <laughs> Got this uh, exquisite. Let me open it. Harry Potter pin. Harry Potter twenty years later. If it will focus, you gonna focus? Nah, you're not gonna focus. That's okay. <laughs> and I got some arcs. I got making friends by Kirsten. I'm not going to try to pronounce that last name. I got Lovely, Dark, and Deep by Justina Chen. I got Maiden Voyage by Sarah Jane. And I got Snow and Love, which is four short stories by Melissa De La Cruz, Nick Stone, uh, Mia Friedman, and Casey West. I probably butchered those names. I got this awesome tote bag which says new stories from authors you love I think that was just a random giveaway they had at the con I went to I got Goodreads books marks Darkest Mind stickers more Goodreads stickers more Goodread buttons I got a sample of a Reaper at the Gate. I got this. I'm not even sure what this is. I guess a mini book of children. Blood and Bone. Oh. I got this. Some lady was standing at the Ingram Sparks section and she's like, here, this is free. I'm like, okay. Now let's talk about what I bought. What I bought was Smoke in the Sun. I don't know if this is a sequel or not because some of those books, they don't, they don't have... They don't have numbers. They don't tell you which one is which. Why Why do we stop numbering our books? Why? Krista Martin was there again, and I got her book, Shadow Crown. And it was, I got it signed. Yeah. I bought, oh, this box. Penguin Teen Unbox. <laughs> and inside of this comes with um, the first two books of An Ember in the Ashes. Nice little pin. I like writing utensils. Another free preview. Ugh. Signed paper. <laughs> this. A show exclusive. Uh, Fall into Fantasy with Penguin Teen. A sequel. Oh, hey, look. Another button that's not going to focus. And I think there's a bag in there. <gasps> I also got this awesome penguin teen tote. Uh, and this was all for Saturday. And for also, my, my biggest thing about Saturday was getting to meet Tommy, whose last name was repeated, repeatedly said 
and I just still can't pronounce it right, but Children of Blood and Bone author. And I got this beautiful signature. Right there. Oops, I gotta remember that stick. Right there is like, I wrote this for queens like you. Although, when I first read that, I thought she put, I wrote this for queers like you. And I went, okay. <laughs> and Angie Thomas. I wasn't originally intending to read this book because I know it's going to be heart filled. It's going to make me cry because I cry at everything. But I just, I just had to. She's, just, she's so awesome and such a nice lady. And it's personalized. I keep forgetting this thing. All right. That was my haul for Saturday. Now my haul for Sunday. All right, let's talk about what I got for free. And that is this children's book. I just spun a wheel, got to pick a children's book. But the thing, the great thing about these children's books is that they're interactive. You open up your mobile phone and it becomes a digital story. And they showed it off and I thought that was pretty cool for anyone who, you know, has kids. And I'm pretty sure, and I know a lot of people with kids. I also got this audiobook for free. It's a murder mystery. <laughs> All these murders keep happening and at first they seem like they're not connected, but then it turns out that they are connected. I got this book, The Trial of Lightning. I didn't get to see the author, but the book is signed and like I said, they were giving it away. Now, they were giving away the third one of this, but then they ran out of copies, so they started giving off the third one. And the only reason why I picked this book up was because it looks like there's Commander Shepard on the cover. Look at it. <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> I should go. Now, let's go into what I bought. And what I bought was... The Darkest Minds. After going to the panel yesterday and always seeing the trailer, I'm like, that book looks interesting. And so, you know... Now, I have other books to read once my to-be-read to be pile gets through. I didn't buy this necessarily, <laughs> but I did get this one signed. I forgot about that one too. The Bells, which I'm currently reading now. I'm halfway through it, almost done. And my last bit of swag, had to buy a t-shirt. I thought it was fitting. Sorry, I'm booked. Oh, well, it's been a fun weekend, but I got work tomorrow, so I'm going to edit this, and then I'm just going to jump into bed and snuggle under the covers and finish reading. Oh, if you want to see the pictures I took, because I took some pretty awesome pictures, you can follow me on Instagram. You know where that link to Instagram is going to be? It's going to be down in the bottom box with the rest of the links to my descriptions, like to my Twitter page and my Twitch page and my website, where you can keep track of all the things that I'm doing, like all the conventions I'm going to. And maybe if you're there and you'll see me and we can say hi. As always, later days. One thing I did forget though, I bought these awesome little posters. This one? And my personal favorite. Okay, now it's really goodbye.